Welcome to Safari Science. My name is Reptile Rob, and learning is fun. So let's learn about snake skin and scales. Ooh, fancy. Hi, Reptile Rob here. I've got my friend Colonel. Hey, Colonel, what's going on? Oh, you're such a cutie. Yes, you are just a cutie little snake. So you might have heard reptiles have scales. And it's true. Scales actually cover the skin of the reptiles. So the scales aren't the skin. But a lot of times when you think of reptiles and scales, because the scales are covering their whole body, we think of it like skin, because skin covers our whole body. Skin covers, covers, covers. It covers our whole body. Now, if you take a look at your arm, you'll see that your arm has little tiny hairs covering it. And if you look on the top of your head, you'll see that you have hair covering the top of your head. So think of your hair like scales. The hair covers your skin. On a snake, the, the scales cover their skin, and the job of the scales is to be like armor. It's great protection against the elements, it's great protection against the terrain, it's also great protection against other animals that might try to eat them. So scales and hair actually have something in common. They're made out of the same stuff. They're made out of keratin, which is a type of protein. So, Funny and interesting and fascinating how while we have skin covered in hair, snakes have skin covered in scales, it's all made out of the same stuff. Keratin, a type of protein. So there you have it, there's some scale talk about snakes, and there's Colonel, I'm Reptile Rob, thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you next time, bye.